Year, what's poppin' loyalists? Welcome back to the channel. This is Dom ZNT, aka Glitch Guru. In this GTA 5 Online video, I'm gonna be showing you guys how to make this goaded, all white, modded jersey outfit. Crazy with the white joggers. We got the white jersey. We got the white long sleeves underneath of it as well. So I'm be showing you guys exactly how to make this from start to finish. Also in this video, I wanna announce the winner of the modded account giveaway. So shout out to Nick Foot for winning the modded account giveaway. He said, yo, let me get that account. I've been rocking with you since OB and Dead Gaming Live. Shout out you out. Three three three. That salt in our rest stack was fire. Appreciate that, bro. Thank you. So I will be getting in touch with you very soon and giving you those account login details. So congratulations. Shout out to Nick. But also shout out to our sponsor of this giveaway, XZX Alejandro. If you guys haven't already, make sure you guys subscribe to his channel. I will leave a link to his channel in the description below. Now with all of that being said, let's get right into this video. Sorry for the lengthy intro, but here we go, guys. So the very first thing that we're gonna do here is we're gonna go into the truck off mission so we can get this white jersey. So basically we're gonna be doing what we do for adversary mode outfits. So we're gonna go in here, we're gonna start this mission up. We're gonna invite anybody. We're gonna make sure that the clothing is set to classic. That's the only thing that we need to change in the settings. And then we can just start inviting people. So I'm in a public session right now, so I'm just gonna invite Anybody that's in this session, everybody who's in that session, plus I'm going to turn on auto invite, matchmaking is set to open as well, so we can have a better chance of having somebody join. I do recommend that you guys wait for maybe two people, maybe three people to join because you never know if this person is going to leave the mission. But once you guys do launch the mission, you want to set versus outfits to competitors. And from there, you want to go over here to where it says view team and you guys want to join the opposite team. Okay, select join team and then you guys will have on the white jersey. If you guys wanna have different color jerseys, you can invite more people so you guys can get more options. All right, so from here, we're just gonna make sure that we're ready. We're gonna ready up and the mission will launch. Now, once we get into this mission, we don't wanna do too much. Make sure that you do not move your character, but we're gonna open up the interaction menu, go to style, helmet visor and we're going to spam it for 30 seconds any direction left or right doesn't matter so i'm gonna go down to style helmet visor and we're going to spam it for 30 seconds once we're done spamming this for 30 seconds if you're on ps4 what you want to do is start up netflix or youtube so we can suspend the gta application if you're on xbox doing this then you guys can just wait for 30 seconds or 40 seconds however long it takes for you guys to get lagged out when you're not doing anything well timed out when you're not doing anything so you guys can do it that way as well so from here i'm just going to do this for 30 seconds spamming it to the right or the left doesn't matter and then i'm going to suspend my application now this is me coming back online so i'm going to show you guys that you might get this error when you come back online okay so i did get that error but it's okay so i just got kicked back to story mode and i launched up an invite only session again so now i'm in the invite only session and we have this outfit on now what we want to do is save this outfit now when you guys go to save this outfit, it is super imperative that you guys save it in slot 19. Okay, so I'm gonna go down to the bottom here and I'm gonna save it in outfit slot number 19 because we will be doing a merge of outfits here in a moment. So this is the outfit that I have, we saved it. Now I'm just gonna swap my outfit and I'm gonna swap it back because I wanna force the game to save. I believe in forcing the game to save so we don't lose any progress, all right? So now that we have forced the game to save, we're gonna swap over to our male character so we can do our transfer components glitch. That way we can merge our white joggers onto this outfit, but we must first get the white joggers. So we're gonna go over to our male character now. We're gonna be doing a male to female transfer, and these are the components that you wanna place on your male character. So go down to the clothing store, and what you guys wanna first put on is the sports jacket, and the sports jacket is called Sea Green Puffer Jacket, all right? So that's the very first component you guys wanna place on your character sea green puffer jacket next we're going to back out we're going to go into designer t-shirts we're going to go down to the bottom here and we're going to put on the pegasus t-shirt all right once we have that we're going to move on so we can get the white joggers now the component for the white joggers is the tan strike boxers so we're going to go over here to where the pants are we're going to go to shorts and we're going to put on the tan striped boxers right here 
Next, we're going to go over here to the sneaker section and we're going to put on the pink plain high tops. Really doesn't matter. All right. Next, we're going to go over here to the accessories and we're going to put on our light woodland tactical gloves. That way we can have our merge gloves on just in case anything goes wrong. We're going to make sure that this merge does work. So this merge is definitely going to work. So once you guys have on all of these components, the last thing that you guys want to put on is your transfer mask, which is the Krampus mask or the stock and any Christmas mask that you guys have. So right here, I'm going to put on the hideous Krampus mask, and that's going to complete our transfer. Now we're going to go down to the time trial, wherever it's located. We're going to hit right D-pad to start the time trial up, and then we're going to go to swap character. Now, if there's an event running inside of your session already, you guys don't need to find a time trial. All you have to do is press options, go to online, and swap characters right there on the spot. As long as you're wearing all of the components on your male character, everything will transfer the same as when you start up the time trial. So from here, once we get to the character selection screen, we're going to select our female character and we're going to load into an online session. And you should notice that you have on all of the components that we had on our male character. It turned into this, the white joggers, and we have on the white long sleeve shirt. So from here, we're going to press options, go to online, jobs, rockstar created versus, and we're going to start up crooked cop. Now, when you start this job up, you want to try to make sure that you are the host so you can set the clothing to player owned or try to make sure whoever's hosting the mission has the clothing set to player owned. So I joined somebody randomly, he is the host, but the clothing was set to player owned and that's the only setting that we need to change in this menu. Once we get here, we wanna go down to owned outfits, switch it once to the left and once back to the right. That's gonna merge the outfit that we have saved in slot 19 with the current outfit that we're wearing. So as you guys can see, we now have the white jersey with the long sleeve white shirt and we have the white joggers on as well. Once we get into this job, we're just going to open up the interaction menu, go to style, accessories, and we're going to go to gear, and we're going to put on an earpiece. Once we put the earpiece on, we're just going to close the interaction menu, open up our phone, and just quit the job. And that's it. Once we load back into the session, we will now have the outfit on that we merged. All right, all right, looking good. Came out exactly the way I wanted it to. This is what I really like about the transfer glitch combined with the merge glitch. We can get the outfits that we want. All right, so once we have this outfit on, we want to go down to the clothing store or go home and save the outfit. Make sure that you guys save it in a different slot besides the one that we have saved in slot 19 so we can get the hat onto this outfit. So what I'm going to do is put that outfit on that we have saved in slot 19 with the hat on it. And we're going to run past the telescope, hit right D-pad, hold the touchpad down to the interaction menu pops open. Once it does, we're going to go down to style, outfit, and we're going to switch to the outfit that we have right here, wherever you saved it. And it's going to combine it with the hat. From there, we're going to go save it. And I think I'm going to put a rebreather onto this outfit as well. So now I'm going to just open up the interaction menu again while I'm wearing that outfit. Go to style, gear, accessories, gear, put on a rebreather, run past the telescope again, hit right D-pad. Hold the touchpad down to the interaction menu pops open. Go to style, outfits, and we're going to just select this outfit right here with the hat and everything on it combined. And that's going to combine the hat with the rebreather plus this outfit that we have here. And now we're just going to go back down here to our closet and save the outfit one last time. I did actually, after the video, I did put on glasses with this outfit as well, like some pink goggles or something like that to match my characters here. And that looks really good too. So this is pretty much it for this glitch, guys. I hope you guys enjoyed this one. I really like this outfit right here. I might make some more colors, man, but I need more people to get into the job. I'm thinking about making a blue one. I don't know if they even have a blue jersey. I think they do. I think we can get that from the versus mission. Let me know. I don't know. But um, yeah, I like this outfit right here. And the shoes still have that whatever that is around the ankles i don't know but it's crazy so definitely a sick modded outfit right here man if you guys enjoyed this video please hit that like button let's try to get this video up to 150 likes guys that should be very easy man i do appreciate all of you guys for watching and sticking with me man the live stream yesterday was really lit so shout out to everybody who came through shout out to everybody who helped as well and shout out to the modded account giveaway winner nick Futt, man shout out to you dude i will be getting in touch with you very soon but 
that's it for this video you guys as always i'm trying to get this channel up to 100,000 subscribers and i need each and every single one of you guys watching to do me a favor hit that like button subscribe to the channel turn on post notifications so you never miss a single video please help me help you you guys and keep bringing you these great gta 5 online videos until next time this is your boy glitch guru officially you peace stay loyal and click one of these videos on the screen man what you waiting for we got choices we got choices click that video right there you see that video click it peace I'm going to